Hello everyone, this is Reese or Brushhead Cub, and welcome back to our Ticket Let's Play adventure series with yours truly. We are underground. I went back into my 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 mine shaft. Uh, I forgot what I called it. I think it was a oh mining deck or something like that. Uh, <laughs> went back down in here and I'm slightly lost. I found this giant endless chasm somewhere right below the desert. So I believe my house is that way. And there's just so much stuff down here. Look at my inventory full of stuff. I've only got one slot left, and that's just because I had some cobblestone. And I went ahead and chunked it in some lava so I'd have more room in case I found something more interesting. Uh, I'm carrying this Philosopher's Stone around with me because someone told me in the in one of my previous video's comments that I can actually use that to craft with. So if we go over it and we hit C, yeah, it brings up a crafting table. So that's pretty cool. And I believe that was the... Oh, I can't remember who did it. I'll put your name in the description, though. Thank you for... for I think it was the Forge right. I think it was probably, yeah, yeah, we'll say it was him, and if it was wrong, it'll be in the, <laughs> it'll be in the description, but yeah, so I got this inventory full of cool stuff, and the only thing I didn't find was diamonds, I only found one of those, but uh, nearly burnt through my diamond pickaxe, so we're gonna start making our way home, and yeah, there's my house, all illuminated, I think this is the way, this looks right, this is, oh, yeah, I've been doing a lot of mining down here, and I just kept going forward, and I actually passed quite a few good looking reserves just because I kept seeing more in front of me. And uh, anyway, in this video, we've uh, updated the server. So we're now on the newest version. I can't tell you what it is because I don't remember, but uh, I know that they removed table crafting table three, which is sad because I liked crafting table three. I didn't have it for very long, but I was, I was getting used to having it around. And it's gone now, so we're gonna have to adjust without it. But updating the server was actually pretty simple. Over on, um, uh, you know, server side, everything got done pretty easily, except for I uh, sort of screwed up a bit. And it was kind of embarrassing, but we, we got it all sorted out. Everything's working, and it uh, could have been easier if I actually read the install directions. But install directions are for uh, for not not for me. What what? Do I need to go down? I think the entrance is on level 15. That's kind of like where I drilled into. That's probably the level I need to get to. What? Wasn't I just here? Hold on. Alright, so it should be somewhere leveled to this area. And I put down... Ah, right there. Okay. I put down that cobblestone pillar. Woo! Hello! Nasty. I didn't bring my sword down here, so I've been down here battling battling it out with, uh, with my pickaxe. Luckily, I did remember to put some food in my inventory, though, so we're... Oh, I didn't even see that. I walked straight back here. I've done all this mining, and this has been right here the whole time. Alright. That's good. That's We don't really need this stuff. We can just transmute more of it if we need to, but... We, we have to have material to transmute with, so that's why I've been doing this. Some lava. don't remember that being there. Uh, I've drilled out some coal, I think, right there. No, maybe silver. Got quite a bit of silver, actually. Yeah, 51 silver ore. And someone actually told me that we can make glass fiberglass cables or glass fiber cables using silver instead of redstone and that it will somehow I believe if you make it with redstone it cre wait no this is wrong I passed the entrance didn't I oh no this is bad guys this is bad okay here we go came out there rah here right Ugh. it's a confusing maze down there but yeah if you use redstone when you're creating them it only gives you four of them but if you use silver it creates six of them. So one diamond and two silver versus one diamond and two redstone. My, my thing was that with that is I don't know what creates more EMC, silver or or redstone. So that's kind of what's going to be the deal breaker there. And look at that. My farm's grown. It's fantastic. Um, someone left my front door open. My brother got on the server and he's been having some issues. So every once in a while, if he's out at night, he'll just come hide in my house. What is... Glass looks different. Um, I don't know. I think that has to do with the texture pack, though. I don't think anything's wrong with the texture pack. Very strange. All right, let's dump all this stuff. Let's get all of our ores into here. Sort those out, and then we'll get all the rest of this stuff. Tons and tons of stuff. Look at all this great, fantastic stuff. We're all out of room in this chest. We're going to have to make a double chest. Let me go get some wood from downstairs. Well, actually... Do they? Can I still make iron chests, I wonder? I, I saw in the notes that they removed something with iron chests, but it might have just been that they updated it to a newer version. So let's find that out real fast. So iron chests, 
if I'm correct, are made by putting a chest like that, an iron around them. Yeah, creates an iron chest, which is worth, whoa, quite a bit EMC. Let's just throw that sucker down, and, um, it's quite a bit bigger. It's about the size of a double chest, looks like. So that's great. We'll just move all of this stuff in there, and we'll do something else with this chest. And you can actually continue to upgrade these to, to like, higher tiers of material. So I think you can make, like, a gold one. And, um, I know eventually you can make a diamond one. And then a diamond glass one that you can kind of see through, which is pretty cool. But I think alchemical chests store more, so I'm not sure if this is really going to be useful at all. Oh, gosh. Oh, gosh. Is that... Yeah, that's normally how I sort them. It's over here instead of up on top, so I was confused. I'm, I apologize. All right, got all that in there. Put our Philosopher's Stone in there, too. Get it all sorted. Fantastic. Got all this other stuff. Won't worry about it. But, um... I know I was saying something important a second ago. I can't remember what it was. I guess it wasn't really that important. But... So what are we going to do in this episode? What's, what's the game plan? What are we... Let's see, we, we could do any number of things, but I think that one thing we should do, one thing we should focus on, is is getting more stuff. Pig? Pig, I saw you. You got out of the fence. You can't be doing that. Look at me. Yeah, you look at me when I'm talking to you. You stay in the fence until I kill you. Then you're dinner, understand? Yeah, you better. You too. I saw you jumping around on the fence. God. These animals, man, no respect. No respect from these creatures. I kind of jumped into this episode without a game plan. I don't normally do that, but as I'm thinking about it, something's starting to form in my mind, and I think I know what I might want to build. I think I want to... Uh, I think I want to build a quarry. Quarries are cool. And we're going to build a quarry... Oh! Before I do anything, though, I remember what I was trying to do a second ago. I was going to check the EMC value of that versus... Silva. And... Okay, silver is worth 512. Redstone is worth 64. So, redstone is worth a lot less than silver dust. Let's check what a silver bar is worth. Have, do I have any made right now? Yeah. Yeah, I'm thinking that we're going to be better off making our fiberglass cables out of redstone. Because they're worth so much less than silver. So, let's do that uh, next time we upgrade our power grid. Because we can just... I mean, we can make tons more redstone using coal. So, no worries there. Right, but today we're going to build a quarry. Let's see how you do that. Let's let's open this up. And look up quarry. Should be right there. All right, we're gonna need a diamond pickaxe, a diamond gear, a gold gear, an iron gear, and redstone. So, a diamond gear is made with a gold gear surrounded by diamonds. Uh, iron gear surrounded by gold. Stone gear, wooden gear. Oh goodness. This is gonna be a long, long chain of building that I can imagine is going to be very very boring but let's just get it started let's let's get all the wood here and let's see in that recipe was this surrounded by cobblestone all right yeah we got plenty of cobblestone oh we got some of my inventory right now and then everything else should be upstairs so we're going to need two three four gold blocks and one two three four five six seven seven iron all together let's just go ahead and get those go get those made and uh, let's go ahead and grab all of our iron out and so we need sticks and I'm actually gonna leave the wood up here from now on inside the crafting table because that's a pretty common building material all right we need one more of those what just happened so confused right, seven and then we're gonna need seven let's see we go so we've got seven stone gears and one extra alrighty and then from there they all have to be upgraded to right they all have to be upgraded to, to iron so let's do that <laughs> I'm struggling here all right and then four of them need to be upgraded to gold which I don't have any gold we got one gold bar. So let's go macerate some gold real fast. Nope, don't even have to macerate it. All we gotta do is uh, cook it up really quickly in the electric furnace. Quantum suit. <laughs> that looks cool. 
focus. You gotta stay focused. All right, 16 should be enough for what we need now. I'm gonna let the rest of those cook up though. And we really need to turbocharge that machine. Not turbocharge. Yeah, there we go, gold. We need to um, overclock it. So we got four of those. And then two of them have to be converted to diamonds, yes. All right, so that means we're gonna need eight diamonds. Let's see how many we've got. Five. All right, so we're gonna have to transmute some things into diamonds which means we're gonna have to convert something. Actually, you know what, I think our uranium ore should be enough to make plenty of diamonds. Now there's there's a catch with this though. Uh, as you guys saw in the last video I did, uranium is a fuel, so it only creates other types of fuels. However, we can cheat the system a bit, and we're going to do that right now by building, have you, a Klein Star? Yeah, which means we're gonna need one, two, three, eight Mobius fuel and one diamond. So, Mobius Fuel, I feel like I created some of that in... Okay, we know we created in that. <laughs> I'm not even going to try to pronounce it. We can convert that back, though, into um, four Mobius Fuel, which means we need four more, which means we're going to need coal. That's coal. Let's we'll do it in the crafting bench so we can see what we're doing. So, it was like this, correct? Creates alchemical coal. I think we need eight of them, too, so this will be perfect. Nope, actually, we're going to need some more. <laughs> oh, man, that stuff just eats up this coal. No joke. All right. Four, so eight. All right. We'll create one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. And then that'll create two more of these. And then we put these in a circle around our diamond. So let's go get our diamond. Wrong chest. Okay, so we got our diamond. And we have our Klein Star. Now what this does is, this is the smallest version of the Klein Star. And it'll actually hold energy that we put into the transmutation table. So let's say we just dump a thing of uranium into this fire here. Boom. The chest is now holding that energy, and if we dump the client star in there, it'll collect it. Now, you'll see up here it still sells fuel. Well, when we remove the client star and drop it back in there, it resets it. It doesn't know what kind of energy is in there, and we can use it to create whatever we want. So, we've now got quite a bit of energy in the client star. Let's grab our diamond. Open this up. We're going to put the diamond here in the center and the client star over here, and it should show us a diamond somewhere. And it's not. Hmm. I wonder why it's not showing us diamond. Well, you know what? That's fine, because we can get plenty of uh, gold, can't we? And uh, only two gold for one uranium? Oh, look at that. They, they redid uranium. I guess in the update, they changed it. It used to be you could get several diamonds from uranium, but they dropped the EMC to about half that of a diamond. That stinks, so that's not going to work. But uh, let's go ahead and... We'll go ahead and get two more things of uh, gold. And we can use that in our crafting bench to create a diamond. That gives us one diamond. And I guess we're just going to have to keep cheating this thing in order to get a few more diamonds. We need to have at least one in here at all times. Right now we have four, and we need four more. So let's... Right now, Nikolite is going to be really useful once we get around to using Blutricity. But right now, it's pretty much pointless. However, it is worth quite a bit of EMC. So let's drop the Klein Star in there. And let's convert all of this over. Wow. All right, and then we want diamonds. How many diamonds do we want? We need four. Easy. Uh, it says I have negative EMC. I don't know what that means. I, didn't, I wasn't aware you could get negative EMC. What is this? Am I supposed to feed it back now? Eat the EMC. I'm now in debt. Oh no, I'm in debt to the transmutation tablet. I don't know what to do. Um, and you know what I just realized? We're going to need three more diamonds in order to... Uh, oh no, this is bad. <laughs> we need three more diamonds in order to build a diamond pickaxe too. Okay, that's fine. We'll just tap into our our precious stone reserves. <laughs> and grab a couple more things of Nikolite. We'll pay off our debt. 
There we go. Okay, debt's paid off. I don't know what's happening right now. And uh, let's feed the EMC. That'll give us... Okay, take it out. Put it back. Continue to feed it. Feed it some more. There we go. And we need three more diamonds. So one, two, three. And we'll just hold on to the rest of that EMC for later. Let's put it up before we cause any more mayhem. Let's put up the Philosopher's Stone too. And uh, let's just continue. We're building a quarry. That's what we're doing here today, guys. That's what we're trying to do here, at least. And let's see. There we go. There's our our diamond gears. And now we've got all the gears we need. Now we just need to make a, a pickaxe. What, what, what What's going on here? Oh, I see. It's just pulling it from down here up into here and creating... <gasps> that is clever. That's fantastic. That's I like that. I don't know if you guys caught that, but it, it saw the recipe and it took stuff out of here and put it back up in here. So, wow, that's, that's, I like that. That's nice. All right, so <laughs> back to building a quarry. Ah, uh, redstone is the last component we need. Let's get some of that good stuff. And uh, let's, let's sort this. Let's get this sorted. This has been one long string of building things. It's all going to be worth it, though, now that we've got our quarry. Oh, this is great. Now, we need a way to power the quarry. And unfortunately, we can't use our our build craft power that we've got going up on the ceiling. So we've got to use engines. So let's create a couple of... We'll go with combustion engines because we've got plenty of coal. And we can just make coal into, like, four charcoal, and we'll have plenty of power. So we need a piston, two iron gears and three iron ingots. All right, we got the iron ingots. How do you make a piston? I don't think I've ever made one. We need cobblestone, iron, redstone, and wooden planks. I'm also gonna leave a stack of uh, redstone in here since, since that seems to be something pretty common that we use a lot. All right, so piston. I can't believe I've never made one in a vanilla Minecraft game. I don't think I ever have. There's our piston. And we're actually going to need... I'm going to go ahead and build three of these. Oh, look. It'll just pull the stuff from our inventory and we can make three of them. Fantastic. And then this combustion engine is going to need iron gears. So we've got to create more more gears. Two, three, four, five, two of them, right? Two of those. Pop, pop. And then iron. Pop, pop. Okay. Open that back up because I'm terrible at remembering glass. Let's go downstairs and we should have glass in our building materials box. Some leftover from when we did the windows. Yep, plenty in there. And I'm getting hungry. I should probably go grab some food. Because I got a feeling I'm going to be wandering out at night to install this thing. And where's my bread? Oh, there it was. Right, I'm not going to worry about that. Which gnaw some apples. Got plenty of apples. Apples are... I love that, that we can now just get apples from trees. That's a fantastic feature. Thank you, Jeb, slash Notch. Um, I like how the glass has attached itself to the to the crafting table. That's great. But staying focused, let's pull this thing back up. Let's put it up there so I'll know what I'm doing. Oh, no, we're all out of iron. Uh, saw that coming, didn't you? And unfortunately, there's none that's already been made. So... Excuse me, I'm gonna go gonna go smelt some down. Alrighty, I believe we've got enough now to to do this thing. <laughs> Perhaps. No promises. Those go there. You know what? I'm gonna need more of these. Uh, I just just caught on to that. I did not create enough. Did not create enough gears. So we're probably gonna need a bit more iron, so I'm gonna put more of that in there to smelt, and when we come back, we should be ready. Alrighty guys, got those sorted, and I just left the machine upstairs, Just it's just burning away because I've got the strangest feeling we're going to run out of iron again before long, and we're going to wish we had some. So, I've already forgotten what it took to build these, but I'm going to try to remember. I think glass went there, and then two of these. Did I just completely ruin that? Maybe some wood involved? No, no wood involved. Yeah, I completely forgot the recipe. Okay, I don't know what I was thinking. Don't know what I was thinking. I just feel stupid now. Should enough to create one, two more. All right, that's three, and that's how we're going to power 
our contraption here. Now we gotta go grab some more cobblestone so we can make switches. <laughs> this is an endless system of just nonsense. Uh, we're gonna need three switches. Probably only need two, actually. But uh, we're gonna get all this sorted. And we're gonna go build this machine. It's gonna be fantastic. You hear me? This machine is gonna be fantastic. All right, so now we've got everything we need, except for now we actually have to pipe the stuff from the quarry, because when the quarry mines, it just dumps the stuff wherever it can, and we actually want it to go somewhere. So, just temporarily grab this chest, and we'll pipe the stuff into the chest, and we're gonna need pipes. So I think we'll go with just basic cobblestone pipes. And those are created, where are they? Piece of glass, two cobblestone. We can manage that with what's in our inventory right now. No, we can't. I never grabbed any cobblestone, did I? Did I just convert it all into... Looks like I created nothing. Okay. Not a problem. Not a problem. We'll get this working. Natural blocks. Cobblestone. I don't know what I'm doing. I don't know if you've noticed. Five of those. Five of these. What a bang! 40 pipes, more than we'll need. I'm gonna leave the rest of this nonsense in here, and this is all we're gonna take out with us, and we're gonna go pick a location to, uh, to plant our, our new contraption. I think I know exactly where I wanna put it. But uh, before I head out there, I'm gonna grab a sword. Because it looks like there's some things still mulling around that might want to kill me. We really need to build a better sword. I think we've got the, uh, the tools to build a diamond one now. We can just go into debt to the machine again to create more diamonds. <laughs> Uh, funny, funny stuff. Alright, so we pretty much drained this area dry of, uh, of useful resources. So we're not even going to bother planting one over here. However, right up here on this hill, this nice flat hill, look at all this room we've got up here. We'll, we'll definitely set it up right out here. Alright, this is definitely it. This is the area. So we're just going to plop down our quarry. Wada bing. And then go ahead and section off an area that's going to be drilling. And, uh, or not drilling, I guess mining. We can make it bigger by making some little markers, but we're not going to do that right now. We're just going to throw down these bad boys. And let's put one underneath it as well. Just like that. Throw down our, or not our torches, our levers. And then our piping. And we'll actually, can we pipe this all the way back to the house? I think it's a bit further than 40. So what we'll do is we'll just pipe it back to right here into this chest. And then later on, We'll, we'll create a pipe that carries it all the way to the house. And so now all we need is to go grab some fuel and we'll get it going. And it just looks like there's a gaping hole in the back of my house. And look, dead stuff. Never noticed that was there before. Hello, squid friends. Squidward. Squilliam. All you others who don't have names. All right, now I've been playing Minecraft for a while. You can correct me if I'm wrong, but I'm pretty sure that char charcoal burns just as well as regular coal. I'm probably wrong on that, but uh, right now I'm pretty sure it does. And where's my Philosopher's Stone? Right there. And if that's true, which I think it is, it means that a single piece of coal creating four charcoal will give us plenty, plenty of uh, a fuel to run this thing for a while. Assuming that charcoal does work better than regular coal, which I'm pretty sure it does, although I could be wrong. We, we will find out. Let's get up here. I think we'll put a half stack in each of these. What is this? Oh no. Oh no, don't tell me we did that. Oh no! How did I make combustion engines instead of steam engines? Oh no! I meant to be making steam engines this whole time, and it ended up with combustion? Wait a second. Wait a second. No. This is what we did. Is this not what we did? Guys? Combustion engine. Iron ingots, pistons, iron gears, glass. Steam engine. Cobblestone. <gasps> oh, I feel like an idiot. Oh my gosh. Well, 
We don't have anything to power these. We don't have any fuel. We don't we don't have any oh man. Ugh. Alright, I'm gonna go inside and make some some Oh. I'm gonna go inside and make some steam engines right now. I can't believe I did that. That's just embarrassing. Oh, I'm such an idiot. Ugh. Alrighty guys. After that harrowing experience. We've returned, and I think we, we're better people now because of it, or at least I am. Uh, learn from your mistakes, and just don't make them again. That's a steam engine there. That's what's going to be powering this contraption. <laughs> it was built, uh, you'll notice, exactly the same, except for instead of using iron everything, it was uh, it was cobblestone everything. So we've now got these three these three combustion engines, and you know what? I now feel compelled to go find some, some, uh, some fuel to use in them, but we'll do that later. Do that in a different project. We would have built those eventually, anyway. I'm sure. And we're gonna load our uh, our charcoal into these things. Half a stack each. Power them up. Not the chest. And boom! Look over there. It started. The process has begun. Now this is uh this yellow piping here is gonna kind of mark off the construction area. And when it's done, it'll actually start mining the resources. And uh, did that one not get turned on? Let's turn that one on. And then now this one is off. There we go. Yeah. Get all you guys working together. That's how it's done. Look how much faster it's moving. All right. I'm going to go ahead and go. Or not go. I'm just going to stop talking. And we'll come back when this thing has started mining. All righty, guys. It's almost finished. Got one more block to go. There we go. And now the arm should appear. And it should start mining up the resources. And just, just as dark starts to set, that's great. Uh, where's the arm at? Why isn't it doing anything? Don't tell me I messed up. Did I mess up? I bet you I messed up again. Oh, I feel like such a failure. Oh, I am not having a honey badger day. I'm not having a honey badger day at all. Hello? Hello? Oh, there we go. That's how it's done, boys. That is how it's done. Look at that. It's pumping the dirt up. It's putting it into the chest over here. Oh, we've done it. We, we, we are successful. We, what, what am I talking about? We, me. I did all this. I'm the one who should be patting myself in the back. In fact, I am. I did a fantastic job. Not only did I get this thing working, but I've got three spare combustion engines just sitting around because that's how cool I am. I can, I can, I can afford to have three spare combustion engines sitting around. Oh man, this is gonna be great. This thing is gonna fill up in no time though. Definitely gonna have to upgrade the way this works, but um, we'll worry about that next time. We're, we're not gonna worry about that today. And I'll just see you guys in the next episode. So uh, thank you guys for watching, and I'll see you later.